Hello YouTubers and 4K TV lovers, welcome back to iTechnology Reviews. In this uh, video today we're gonna do the 55 inch TV. So I know we made a review for this TV but there are still areas uncovered like for today we're gonna talk how to connect your subwoofer by Bluetooth with this TV and the speakers integrated in your TV still work. So you can use a soundbar for example with subwoofer and your speaker's TV running at the same time. For our example today we will give the Harman Kardon Go Play will connect it in the same time with the TV. So after this idea I will show you how to reboot hard reboot your uh, TV if you have problems if it's broke. So first let's go and I'm going to show you in the accessibility let's connect the multi audio output. This is the option you want to click it. Now my Harman Kardon it's already connected. Yeah okay. So now my Harman Kardon is connected, the TV is in volume, so by now if we can connect and remotely uh, control the sound of the Harman Kardon by Bluetooth, by the, that uh, protocol A2DP, now we can uh, select the TV speakers, so in the Bluetooth speaker or Bluetooth subwoofer you can adjust the volume and you can use the dual sound. So now, if you can hear, it has a delay between. This is normal. Uh, I really thinking um, to an idea how to adjust this delay. Sincerely, I cannot think otherwise than the, um, the secret menu. We have a review for the secret menu and a tutorial to unblock two new features. Uh, please watch that secret menu because you will uh, gain and I'm sure I'm not, we're not gonna to go into the secret menu today, but I'm sure there is some delay adjustment between the speakers and the Bluetooth electronic, your subwoofer, your Bluetooth uh, portable speaker. I don't know, whatever you want to connect with your TV. And maybe there is a way to adjust this uh, delay because it's quite annoying. For a subwoofer, a Bluetooth subwoofer, I don't think you will sense this delay. I think will be the best. You get a boost from your um, TV. You get a great sound using the highs and the mids from the speakers of the TV and the bass from the subwoofer. So you will get a, a good sound. Okay, so guys, another thing it's I had problems, I don't know, from the videos, from uh, blocking sometimes, I don't know, in the YouTube, uh, in the channels, I cannot change the channels to the TV. So you got to do a hard reboot. A hard reboot, guys, is using the power key and the sensor in the front of your remote control with the sensor of the TV. A great way to do this, guys, is uh, to point the front of your remote control to the uh, sensor to the sensor of your TV and point it and hold the power button hold it hold it hold it a long time and yes until appears the Samsung Smart TV logo and now you did to your TV a hard reboot now the comments must work and uh, your channels must uh, and the application must work correctly this application blocking to my TV are very rare, I think, two times since I bought it. Um, it didn't make me problems, but uh, a new update maybe, maybe will uh, fix these problems to this TV. Guys, I don't recommend you to make updates to these TVs. Um, we made the video uh, preventing and warning users not to make updates because we had a full HD TV. And once you made two or three updates, it decreases the quality of the YouTube. So the, that TV from full HD dropped to HD on YouTube. This is not possible. Samsung did this. Yes, it was full HD. This was a great image. But when you watched that TV, it was uh, decreased uh, after a few updates. Uh, the quality from full HD to 720p. This is not good. This is not very nice, Samsung. So my uh, Samsung uh, brand lover, because in TVs it's premium. It's a premium brand. The premium displays the 
biggest and the greatest displays on earth in this manufacturer gathered the uh, Got a lot of lot of prices every year for the greatest displays and no one can contest this guys if you like this video please subscribe to our channel please thumbs up and support our videos guys and thank you for watching have a great day guys see you bye